Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So we're watching episode six today. Um, I still have my guest over from last week. She's still here. She's also watching it in the living room again. And so if you hear noise, that's what it is. But I, oh crap, it's the older actresses. So I'm, I'm honestly so excited to see Emma and Olivia. I, I love Olivia Cook. She's a great actress, so I have complete faith in her, but I'm also really excited to see how Emma portrays this character. That's pretty much all I have to say. Um, I, I'm just really excited. I want to get to the episode, so let's go. Uh, uh, hate breathing. <laughs> I'm actually so sad that the young Renera isn't going to be here anymore. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <laughs> Oh, these noises. Oh, gosh. Princess, the queen has requested that the child be brought to her immediately. What the fuck? She literally... Why? Barely gave birth. What, does Allison want to see if it's, um, a boy or girl? Oh, it's coming. The afterbirth. What's coming? I'm not a mom, so I don't know what the heck's going on. What's the afterbirth? A boy. Oh my gosh. Lainor. So, so grown. Was it terribly painful? <laughs> she didn't have any time to brush her hair, shower, or anything. My deepest sympathies. Oh, if any moms out there can tell me, like, would they do this? Can you walk right after? Like, right after giving birth? I have a couple mom friends. Maybe I'll ask them. Walk. What could she possibly want? I thought we were past this. Oh my god, I feel like it's gonna take some getting used to, to be like, this is Rhaenyra. And this is Lainor. And that's Alicent. Ah, uh, where's Viserys? If... <laughs> We are turning back, all right? Mm, so I forgot what the time jump is between the last episode and this episode. Oh, I'm a little bit sad that we can't see like the dynamic grow between Alison and Renera. Like I know it's not really feasible with the like the scope of this story. <laughs> oh, princess. Kristen, you're still salty? How many years has it been? Rhaenyra, you should be resting after your labors. I have no doubt that you would prefer that, Your Grace. You must sit. Okay. What happy news this morning. Indeed, Your Grace. Oh gosh, he looks like he's ready to go. <laughs> that, with the first delivery of that line, I forgot to say this, but I was thinking it. Olivia Cook. She's gonna be so good at being a bitchy queen. I'm so excited. Yes, you will. Does the babe have a name yet? We haven't spoken. Joffrey. Oh. He'll be called Joffrey. It's an unusual name for a Valerian. I do believe he has his father's nose. <laughs> Don't you? Yeah, that's not their kid, huh? She's like, don't. Dude, that kind of sucks. Okay, Allison, that's not your kid, like. Do keep trying, Selena. Sooner or later you may get one who looks like you. <laughs> oh, Allison. You don't think to consult me before you name my child. He's our child, is he not? If any one of us is bleeding. I deserve some say in the affairs of my own family. Is he though? Is he your kid? <laughs> oh. Is that Kristen? <sighs> is it the same actor? Look. Is it the same actor? Like, I need to. I'm sorry, I have to look this up. Okay, I don't know. I'm trying to look it up, but it's taking too long. 
Um, also kind of sad we didn't get to see their relationship blossom. Oh, those are Allison's kids too. Cover Max to heal Princess Eris. The It's so cute. Dracaris Vermax. Not the poor little what is it? A lamb? A sheep? <laughs> That's so sad. Eamon, we have a surprise for you. You're the only one of us without the dragon. Indeed. And we felt badly about it. So, we found one for you. <laughs> First flight's always rough. <laughs> well, I thought they were going to be, like, making fun of, like, Renera's kids and stuff, but... Seems like they're all pretty friendly so far. What is this kid doing? <laughs> Which one was that? Oh, is this Helena? This one has 60 rings. And two pairs of legs on each. That's 240. Yes, <laughs> She's like, my kid is so fucking weird. Eamon. What have you done? He did it again. After how many times you've been warned, must I have you confined to your chamber? He made me do it. As if you needed encouragement, your obsession with those beasts goes beyond understanding. They gave me a pig! They said they found a dragon for me. The last ring has no legs at all. You will have a dragon one day. He'll have to close an eye. I know it. Uh, wait, why did she say that? <laughs> And a tail. Why did she say that? Child, your grandsons are a menace. They're savages. And it's not surprising. It's a wonder to me their eggs ever hatched. To have one child like that is a mistake. A brunette. <laughs> to have three is an insult. She's basically saying those are not his kids. I went to Comic Con and um, the younger actresses and the older actresses were there, they said they did not consult each other at all about how to play the characters. So I think this will be very interesting. Like this one already seems more outright evil. The fuck? The pig. Was it your plot? No. It, it was the two of them. Edmund is your brother. Oh, he's a twat. <laughs> we are family. We must defend our own. It was funny. Renir will ascend the throne and Jocera's Targaryen will be her heir. So? Oh. You are nearly a man grown. How is it that you can be so short-sighted? She can move to cut off any challenge to her succession. You are the challenge! Oh. You are the challenge! Oh my Eagle. gosh. Like living and breathing! You are the king's firstborn son. Is that one day you will be our king? No, the fuck you won't. Ugh, the thing that... Like, I know this is the point of the story, but the thing that bothers me is she's doing to him what her dad did to her. Ah, Damon, finally. Ooh, Elena? Fuck, they're huge. <laughs> what? Okay, that was cool. <laughs> the proposal I wish to make? In the spirit of honoring our storied alliance. Your aim is to marry one of our daughters, Your Excellence. You might have said so and spared us the history lesson. What? <laughs> I wish to <laughs> offer you a permanent residence here in Pentos. Lys and its allies rise again. My aim is to protect Pentos from the lustful eye of the Triarchy. Aid Pentos in this, as Egon once did. And my gratitude will fill your cup and overflow it. 
accept a most generous offer. And one we will certainly entertain. We don't belong here. Valeria is gone. We don't belong anywhere. Oh, I, why did I just realize she's pregnant? <laughs> I want my child to be born where I was born, on Driftmark. I want my daughters to be raised in their homeland with their family. At my end, I want to die a dragon rider's death. His side eye just cracks me up. This is the stuff, Lino. Lads that learn together, <laughs> train together, knock each other down, pick each other up. You'll certainly form a lifelong bond, wouldn't you? <laughs> Egg on. He's a little shit, isn't he? Did he just hit it? <laughs> ah. Weapons up, boys. Give your enemies no cause. Seems the younger boys could do better with a bit of your attention. Sir Christopher. Trisharis. You spar with egg on. <laughs> He's like, huh. Damn, I can't believe Kristen Cole is still... He never let it go, huh? That Renera didn't want to go with him. Play. I'll deal with him. <laughs> There's just so many weird vibes there. You! Use your feet! Don't let him get up. Stay on the attack! Jesus. Enough! You dare put hands on me! They're gone! <laughs> You forget yourself, Strong. That is the prince. This is what you teach, Cole. Cruelty. To the weaker opponent. Your interest in the prince thing oh is quite unusual, Commander. Most men would only have that kind of devotion toward a cousin. <gasps> or a son. Or a son. Oh my gosh. Christian Cole was so... He was, like... The first few episodes. And now he really gives me the... Princess. There's been an incident in the yard. Your intimacy with the Princess Rhaenyra is an offense that would mean exile and death. For you. For her. For the children. Do they have DNA tests in the... Game of Thrones world. It's been eight years, sweetly. <gasps> Half of them never do, you know. What? Mm. Hatch. Oh, so cute. She's let me stay. playing with her little egg. <laughs> there is more than one way to bind yourself to a dragon. I was without one until I was 15 years old. And now I ride a big arc. The largest in the world. But if you wish to be a rider, you must claim that right. Your father will tell you the same. Father ignores me. He's doing his best. I'm very interested to see Damon as a dad. Leonor has written. Rhaenyra has delivered another son. <laughs> Does your brother mention if this one also bears a marked but entirely coincidental resemblance to the commander of the Sith Lord? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because like, they, oh, they, them two are like kind of equivalent to like Lenor and Renera, right? They should have like kids that look pretty much the same. Uh, we should address the latest developments in the Stepstones, my lords. Oh, ever be shut up, that blasted. If you ask me, I think the Blackwoods have the upper hand. <coughs> to trust a Martell is to be disappointed. Oh, to trust a Martell is to be disappointed. They did not. Let us be finished. 
Damn, they really, they really do fucking despise each other now. Wait. I have felt the strife just... between our families of late, my queen. And for any offense given by mine, I apologize. But we are one house. Long before that, we were friends. Yeah. My son, Jaceris, will inherit the Iron Throne after me. I propose we betroth him to your daughter, Helena. Ally ourselves. This is a good idea. Let them rule together. A most judicious proposition. <laughs> He's so old. Additionally, if Cyrax brings forth another clutch of eggs, your son, Aemond, will have his choice of them. Uh, a symbol of our goodwill. Oh, she seems so proud of herself. Oh. The king and I thank you for your offer and we will consider it duly. You must rest now, husband. He's obviously on board with it. She feels the earth washing away beneath her feet and now she expects us to ignore her transgressions and for me to marry my only daughter to one of her plain featured sons. The proposal is a good one, my queen. Yes. Let us put aside these childish quarrels. Join hands and be stronger for it. You may do as you wish, husband. When I am cold in my grave. Alison. Alison. From, like, at this point of view, like, right now, she's an idiot. <laughs> her dad kept warning her about all these, like, if you're... Like, Rhaenyra will challenge your heirs and blah, 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 blah. This is a good solution. <laughs> and she's literally just, like, over my cold, dead body. Like, are you serious? The king is resting. I have come to resign my position as Hand of the King. Why? The episode in the yard this morning. My son, Harwin, has disgraced himself. Young Harwin's outburst was unfortunate. It's true. But he's been expelled from the city watch. That seems punishment enough. Forgive me, Your Grace, it is not. No, he's a good hand of the king. Oh, from what I've seen. <laughs> Your advice has been sage. Unmarked by self-interest. <laughs> Stands in contrast to all others. <laughs> you speak kind words. <laughs> what is this shadow? Name it if it casts such a gloom. Yes. You must have your reasoning in plain language. I cannot. Is he actually like that? Blind? You will continue in your service to the crown. I would then ask leave to take my son from court and escort him back to the family seat at Harrenhal. Hmm. Okay. Do it. And what the fuck is she so pissed about? Because he doesn't want to say that the rumors about Rhaenyra and Harwin's kids. And where's his other son? The little rat. <laughs> Damn, she's just a, a bitch. <laughs> I feel like I am kind of having a hard time. Like, the old, old Alicent was so sweet. The old Renair was such, like, she was more sassy, more playful. Like, I know it's been 10 years, but yeah. King had an audience with my father. He attempted to resign his post. Interesting, you said attempted. My lord husband refused to accept. Then he fell short of confessing my brother's transgressions. Lord Lionel is to escort Sir Harwin back to Harren Hall to watch over his seat whilst he continues to serve his hand. My father cannot give unbiased counsel to the king. It is now that I must rue the absence of my own father. You cannot say, my queen, that your father would be impartial in this matter. No, but he would be partial to me. And where is her father after all these years? I wonder if we're going to see him again. He is a no one to take my side. So weird. Why is he so, like... I feel like he's, um... Kind of betraying his family. Like, why is he so up Allison's ass? Who's that? Who are these people? What a collection of heroes I have before me. For your crimes, you've been sentenced to death by hanging. He's going to offer them something, huh? I am prepared to offer Oh my gosh, what if he... Mercy. Like... If you're prepared to pay a 
little price. What? What? Hmm. I've reached the limit of my art. Yeah, my brave girl. Is she gonna die? I could lay open the wound. Try to remove the infant by way of the blade. But I cannot say for a surety whether it lives or the mother survived it. No, just like her Nera's mother. They are Dragaris! What is she doing? Is she just like committing suicide? Dragaris! Dragaris! He's like, no, mommy. That's... He doesn't want to. Oh, come on, girl. You can still try. Oh, he's gonna do it. Lena! Ah, uh, she did say she wants to die in, like, a... Um... A dragon rider's death. Be good to your mother, lad. Oh, man. I'll visit when I can. I will return. I promise. I wonder if they know that's his death. <laughs> or are they just like, damn, this man spent a lot of time with us. We'll exchange letters by Raven. Might that be fun? Oh, how and strong my father. <laughs> we're finished here. We're leaving. You always said if you were absent from court, she would pour her honey in your father's ear. The wise sailor flees the storms it gathers. Mm. Leno, bring him. The kids? We'll need every sword we can muster. Oh, that guy. Hmm. Who's that? Who's that? Ooh, what is that? And who's the new hand of the king? <coughs> Did he get poisoned? Is he dying? You guys, no. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, I actually was not expecting that. Twitter spoils everything for me, but they didn't spoil that. He looks just ready. He looks ready to go. Oh, her mom. Dude, what the fuck? Her dad. You've heard the stories of Harren Hall, Your Grace. It is said to be a cursed place. But it passes judgment on all who pass beneath its gates. You. You pass judgment. So he. The queen makes a wish. What servant of the realm would not strive to fulfill it? He killed his own dad and brother? Laris. I did not wish for this. What the fuck, bro? You will reward me when the time is right. Wow. Fuck him, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> so, Allison has been mad at Renera for 10 years for having sex and lying to her about it. Like, okay. Why? I don't understand. It did like. Do you guys think she actually like liked her, or was she jealous that she got to experience some kind of freedom and like sexual <laughs> encounters with other men? Um, I really don't know. Like, that's the only thing that doesn't make sense to me in this show is Alicent and Kristen Cole have it out for Renero for no fucking reason. Like, Kristen, you or her knight 
And now he's like nowhere near her anymore. So, what the fuck? <laughs> I just don't understand. Like they, they're so both so petty. So I understand why they are, they like combine forces because they both hate her. Kristen, man, he it's ten ten years. Just get over it. <laughs> so I think I feel like the first, the other Allison was like. Um, I think she was at least likable, like her younger version. I'm not even, oh shoot, sorry. I'm not even talking about the actress, but Allison herself, she was likable because she was younger. She was, she, I think she had a good heart, but after she found out what Renera did to her, like lying to her, I think she just was like, okay, fuck this. I'm a green now. And she has her children in green. There are Targaryens, why are they in green? Why is Viserys, like, not saying anything? How do you guys feel about the new actors? I... Listen, I love them. They're great so far. It's just... We got attached. Like, well, I'm speaking for myself. I got very attached to the other actors. Like, they're doing great so far. I just miss their, their faces. Like, to me, they are... Allison and Renera. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this, please remember to subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you liked this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!